Hey loves, welcome to Robo Kai. This reading is going to be for you, the viewer. Please, please, you know your situation and what applies to you. So please take what resonates and leave the rest. All right, I'm just going to get some energy um, as far as how you've been feeling and get some advice from spirit and then close it off with a few messages for uh, the person that has you on their mind. Okay, so let's go ahead and see how you have been feeling, viewer. Hopefully well. Well, happy, abundant. <laughs> Let's see. Again, you only want to take the messages that are relevant to you in your life right now. So you may want to hang tight, okay? Let's get a few cards from Spirit. See what Spirit has for you, okay? I will not be taking reversals, just so you're aware. I will clarify the energy to the best of my knowledge. All right. Starting off, I see the Two of Swords. Four of Swords. Hangman. Ooh, Empress. Okay. See levels, all right. Levels. Some of you guys were having a difficult time making some type of decision, all right. Um, this could also be how someone has been feeling about you, so please take it as it applies. But someone was having a difficult time making a decision, all right. They were really at a crossroads, and um, it took them a bit of. I could see some stagnant type of energy. I could see some procrastination in this, so I feel that they. I already knew which direction they really wanted to go in or you possibly know the direction that you want to go in but something had been keeping you bonded something had been keeping you a bit stuck or um i'm hearing a bit confused okay maybe you were waiting for something to change is what i'm hearing um with the four swords coming out next i do feel that you've gained a sense of an idea of the direction that you'd like to take even if you hadn't necessarily made the move yet because i still see the hangman is here so i do feel that you hadn't necessarily made that transition into where you want to be but you are headed in that direction at least you have um come up with the idea of what you want to do all right we have the empress here so i feel that some of you guys are deciding to do something new try something new um you don't want to you don't want to stay too comfortable or stagnant in your current energy and i feel that at this time you could be facing some type of fears or facing some type of challenges all right i feel with the empress energy you guys are going to be highly highly impressed by the reward you receive from taking this risk and taking this um, leap of faith the choice that you are making the direction that you are headed in is looking like something that is very foreign to you it's different for you but it's also very rewarding for you okay um some of you guys could have been a bit hesitant because of fears because of um, anxieties simply um thinking that what would happen i don't know about this environment i don't know about this relationship i don't know about this place um should i really try this should i really do this and i feel that overall you know that it's the best decision for you it's just so new and so unknown that it could become a bit you know can make you feel a little anxious okay else you got here but i'm seeing that if you are having a hard time making that decision you will have some support you will not be f uh, left to figure things out on your own you will have a very very solid and firm support system i'm also getting though you have to be willing to communicate you have to be open to letting people know let people in on what's going on with you okay if you have fears and you have doubts or concerns um find your your group Find your tribe that understands you. They're going to be honest with you and not just tell you what you want to hear. Okay, so find that group of people that genuinely has your best interests at heart and feel free to confide in them because I do feel that they're going to provide you with either resources or just support to make you more comfortable 
in making this decision, okay? At times you could have felt that you didn't really know what to do because you felt you were doing it all alone, okay? We're looking at the two of swords here. So it's like, I gotta do all this by myself. What do I do? What do I do? Um, and then like hidden here, you have the three of cups that let you know like, hey, there are people out there that are willing to advise you or people that are out there that are willing to help you if only you would open up. Okay, so don't be afraid to open up. The three energy I'm seeing here with the three of cups as well as the empress makes me feel that um, there's going to be some collaboration. There's going to be some cooperation. So if you are willing to confide in others, then just know for sure they will have your back. They will have your back. It's not to say that everyone will. You have to utilize your discernment to pick and choose who is going to really have your best interest at heart. Um, because I do feel that there are going to be some people who want you to kind of stay in the cradle, okay? Stay still, stay where you are, or do what they feel is best for you and really is more beneficial to them, all right? So make sure that you are not being led by someone else's... Um, overall goal for themselves and like you're fitting into someone else's picture that could keep you stagnant okay so make sure that you're speaking in people that truly truly have your best interests at heart all right so that is what i have on a message from spirit for you viewer i'll go ahead and get some messages from the person that has you on their mind and i'll close this on out short and sweet <laughs> messages from the person that has you on their mind what would they like to say at this time what would they like to tell you or have they been hiding or keeping from you during the shuffle i saw i want you only and i saw a divine counterpart so maybe someone uh they're having a bit of fear i saw pisces is giving like the moon energy and the um, pain man energy it makes you feel like someone has been hesitant to come forward even though they feel that you are their divine counterpart they're never going to find a connection like yours and theirs again but they are afraid to face this they're afraid to face you at this time for some of you but too soon all right so someone is definitely feeling like you gave up on them you gave up on the situation too soon I do feel like I'm hearing it's your decision. It's your decision. So if someone isn't on board with what you decide for yourself and for your betterment, um, that's a personal problem. And I feel spirit is just wanting you to be aware that at times people could project their energy onto you and make you feel like it's your problem. Really, it's theirs. All right. But someone definitely is feeling that you quit too soon. On um, I'm getting more so a connection with them. So it could be a relationship. And they are not happy about it. <laughs> I'm getting um I didn't want to say it but <laughs> I'm getting like you know when there's certain situations they're like you didn't do you didn't give a two weeks notice <laughs> you didn't do this you didn't do that like you didn't take the proper measures to handling something it's like someone wanted you to do something a certain way and you did it your way and they're they're trying to guilt trip you for doing it your way okay they feel like you could have tried harder or something like that i feel that you've made a decision it was your decision it was the right decision <laughs> pisces came out anyway all right so some of you guys could strongly be dealing with the pisces um i'm also getting again that stagnant energy with the hangman being here and it's still being on the top of my deck so it makes me feel like um there's a pisces who could be having a difficult time uh connecting with you telling you how they truly feel about you i feel that there's also an energy with that pisces type of dynamic that um there's someone they don't have to be a pisces but there's someone who has hidden feelings they have rep uh, repressed feelings for you um i'm getting like unfinished business with you but the reason they are not coming forward is because they feel that you are not um willing to hear them out you're uninterested in dealing with them or talking to them or um, there's some type of fear associated with this um, individual so they're not coming forward I also get an energy like they're not going to come forward if you were expecting them to I think this person they are willing to embrace their you know stagnant energy rather than face their fears 
they're just not ready they're just not ready okay we're not gonna fault them for that please don't fault them for that viewer whoever this person is you're dealing with sometimes you're just gonna have to forgive and forget okay if you if they've disappointed you forgive and forget um accept an apology that was never given because this person they they have a lot of like built up tension um anxieties frustrations things that really keep them blocked from facing their own fears so um i really wouldn't expect them to step forward if i were you is what i'm seeing here you the one i want to be next to all right some of you guys could be or dealing with a fire sign aries leo sagittarius but i feel this person is sure about you they um appreciate the connection that you guys share it seems very passionate I'm even picking up like romantic, all right? So this could be a lover of yours, but they love being around you. They enjoy your quality time. They enjoy your energy. I'm hearing sense of humor. So someone could really like the fact that you're not too uptight, you're not too serious. They like that they could be themselves and even a bit playful around you. So I feel this person is constantly surrounded by people who are maybe a bit serious or um, they could just work a lot and be around a lot of um, professional type of energy. But I feel when they get around you, they're able to play. They're able to relax and <laughs> let their guard down. And they like that. They look forward to that. So someone um, is looking forward to connecting with you. I'm picking up very soon. All right. So maybe they're ready to ditch a whole group of people work or something like that so that they could be next to you. Break the silence. This is coming back again. And I'm being like drawn to that Pisces energy. All right. So again, when we're talking about with that, someone does not want to come forward or speak up, maybe they will surprise you. As I said, I wouldn't hold my breath <laughs> if I were you, viewer, but it seems that someone may just shock you and surprise you. Maybe you're feeling the way that I've been feeling. I'm picking up on the energy that you don't expect this from them, but they may just come through and break the silence, okay? I feel um, some of you could have someone in your corner that they're not willing to give up. They're not willing to quit. They know that if they were to release this connection with you, it'll be for good is what I'm picking up. Like you um, may be gone for good, but I feel that some of you guys are going to experience um, some type of awakening with this individual. They're going to, first of all, shock you by contacting you, reaching out to you. You're not going to expect it. And then two, the things that they have to say, the way that they feel may also catch you off guard, okay? You would have never expected that they had these feelings towards you or about this connection. I feel this person is going to be very vulnerable with you, um, very honest with you. And I don't know why I'm picking up like cold-blooded. You may view this person as cold-blooded, so you never expected them to confide in you and tell you you know how they truly feel i'm now thinking again of repressed feelings it's like everything that they've been holding back you're gonna find out viewer and um it may just shock the fuck out of you <laughs> okay what else we got here we'll get one more and we'll close it on out Still got the tasty on the tip of my tongue. All right, so some of you guys could be dealing with Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, but they are reminiscent is what I'm getting, reminiscent. This person, they think of you, possibly dream of you. They miss you. They miss you. They want to talk to you. Um, I don't think that this is someone that you've been that distant from or had any type of bad... Um, break up or anything way it could be if that is your energy you would know take what resonates right but i feel that this is more so someone that you possibly see um every now and then um i'm picking up like maybe you guys maybe you go to the gym you see this person you don't even know this person is like feeling you like that um maybe you go to work and you see this person and they got the hots for you or in some type of dynamic this person they flirt here and there but they don't really have a true connection with you like you guys don't speak outside of whatever dynamic you know each other and and so i feel that this person they want to be around you they want to chit chat flirt you know kind of get the 
essence of you is what I'm getting with that. Still got the taste of you on the tip of my tongue. It's like this person, once they leave the dynamic with you, they leave work or they leave the gym or they leave wherever they see you or deal with you at, once they leave that environment from being with you, when, and when they're out and about in other situations or other connections, they're still thinking of you. They're still reminiscent upon how you made them feel. And I feel this person they could also be receiving downloads that you are for them. I'm getting an acquired taste. So this may be like an opposites attract type of situation. This person, they may be very different from your usual type, but I feel like they really are attracted to you. Um, they want a bit more. They feel like they only have a hint of who you are. It's like a hint of viewer, a hint of lime. Uh, they want the whole meal, okay? So this person, they haven't really gotten to know you or fully connected with you the way that they would like to, and it just piques their interest even more. So some of you guys are basically dealing with a secret admirer here that could possess very strong earth energy towards Virgo Capricorn. All right, and so at the very bottom, we have still living single. All right, so someone is still living single. You could have felt that someone was out there doing the most, but I feel that someone just wants to reassure you that they have not been in a relationship with anyone since they've been dealing with you or since they dealt with you, since the separation, if there were a separation. Someone has been by themselves and really taking their time out to heal. All right, that may also surprise you. I feel like someone could even be confiding in you and letting you know this. You may not believe them, but I do feel that it's the truth with the message coming through for you today. So that's what I have for you guys. I hope it helps. Again, please take what resonates. Leave the rest. I love you. We'll see you next time.